This is our first recipe from Meat Cookbook. Meat Cookbook. It's from the Frankfurt chapter. It's called Wiener Winks. Okay. I made you two. Oh. Okay, so they're good. I was very, very careful following the, the, the instructions, and I still burned them. Ooh. Which I think is extra authentic. Why does it have an olive in it? It's supposed to have an olive. I don't know. Perch olives on toothpicks. Perch it. So Perch. it's not to pierce the olive twice with a toothpick. Right. Is that the wink? Is the is the olive the wink? I don't know. Well, on this side it doesn't look like a wink, but on this side it kind of does. Oh, the hot dog is winking? No, I don't know. I don't know. The bun is winking. It looks... Maybe they just thought it was a cute word. It's got a little periscope. Yeah, I like how they look like um, a little formation of submarines. Ready? Is this, is this recipe from before there were, were, there were hot dog buns? Because it kind of seems like... Like I've made a hot dog bun. No, look, here's hot dog buns in a picture on the page right before. Okay. Starts with a slice of white bread. You butter one side. Dip the buttered side in Parmesan cheese. You mix chopped onion with mustard, and you spread that on the other side. Then you just sort of wink a hot dog into it, burn the shit out of it, and then stick an olive on top. I only cooked it about half as long as you're supposed to because they were burning. Um, but you can see I even burned. I burned the toothpick and everything. All the ingredients seem fine. Yeah. The presentation's odd. Kind of like you ran out of hot dog buns. That's what... I don't know. Let's go. Buttery. Yeah. Butter, good. Cheese, good. It's fine. Oh, you know what happened? No one had invented mm. toasting hot dog buns yet. Compared to an unbuttered hot dog. The butter might not be necessary. Yeah. Also, I'm barely getting any cheese. That's what you think. The, the last taste is Parmesan cheese. Not that bad. It's a hot dog. That somebody put a toothpick and an olive into. You know what your guests would love? <laughs> hot dogs. Who wants to go to the ballpark? When you can make wiener winks at home. If you just put a hot dog in a bun with mustard and onions on top, even if you went to the trouble of melting butter over it, it would still seem weird and not that fancy if you stuck this in. But f buns. We got like bread. This no, this is not better. This is not better than buns. Not better than buns. On the other hand, if you really didn't have buns, this is actually not that bad. An alternative. Have like I've tried to eat a hot dog just in a piece of bread. It sucks. Butter, mustard, and onion on anything. It's gonna taste pretty okay. But it stays together. I don't know well, why I'm trying, trying to The closer the bread gets to a bun shape, the more closely it resembles a bun, the better it's gonna be. Okay. Buns. Join us next time when we try deviled ham bean bake. One can deviled ham, mustard, salt, a can of beans, one tablespoon fat. That's not going to work out. Fluffy dumplings. Flumplings. <laughs> <laughs>